welcome back to another Gemini Jets fan video and today we're going to be covering airport update number 3 for Flynn by Shop International Airport update for you guys. Uh, before you, we don't know this video and I forget to give this video a like, subscribe to the channel, turn on post notification bell so you'll be notified every time I post a new video. With that being said, uh, we are currently 9 days away from my birthday as of recording. But when you guys are watching this, we're actually eight days away from my birthday. So, yeah, hopefully you guys are excited for the massive unboxing coming for my birthday. We do have a lot of models coming very, very soon. And I know they're going to be exciting for you guys. I know you guys are going to love them. And I've seen many of you already saying you guys are super, super excited for massive unboxing. And can't wait. It will be coming very soon. And each and every one of you will be very impressed. With that being said, let's get into this beautiful Flint Buy Shop International Airport. Starting off right here in the little section uh, right next to the taxiway where the little curve is right here. Where I usually, I'm putting my cargo planes because the cargo area I have not been able to build. Because that's right over the runway back there. But uh, without that being said, so now let's go into the first aircraft. Right here we have an MNG Cargo Airbus A300-600. This aircraft is getting loaded up, operating as a FedEx a300 and he's going to be pushing back very soon in around 40 minutes for a flight out to memphis tennessee right here holding short for runway 1a we have a beautiful allegiant air mcdonald douglas md83 of course operating as an airbus a320 like i always put it in for and this aircraft is going to be heading out to orlando sanford and right here there's something a little bit new which i decided to switch up uh, i've been switching it up with the erj 145 today i decided to throw in an erj 175 so right here, holding short of the taxiway right here. So basically, this plane pushed back and came over here because this area is very full. But yeah, this beautiful United Express Bombard, eh, sorry, Ember ERJ 175 uh, LR. Uh, I think that is what it is with the enhanced winglets. But he's holding short of that runway right there for the Allegiant to move. And he's about to continue when the Allegiant moves out of the way. And he's going to be heading out to Chicago O'Air. I decided to upgrade in my airport update to an ERJ-175 just to make it more interesting. Right there on final, we have a beautiful Allegiant Air, Airbus A319, operating as an A320 because an A319 doesn't have sharklets. So it's operating as the A320, and this aircraft is coming in from no other and no less than Punta Gorda, Florida. Right here, pulling into gate one, we have the regular Chicago hair service on the beautiful United Express Bombardier Series 200. Pulling into the gate from Chicago O'Hare on the regular CRJ 200 flight. And the gate is right there with the catering truck for him to get serviced when he comes in. Right here we have a beautiful American Airlines Airbus A319 in the America West Heritage colors. Getting heavily, heavily serviced with the gate and passengers on getting loaded up. Uh, the uh, fuel, yeah, and the catering truck and all that stuff. And this aircraft is going to be pushing back shortly for a flight out to Charlotte as operating at the CRJ dash 700 i do plan on getting a series 700 for my birthday for massive unboxing let's see how it goes i don't foresee it coming though because it's already up to 60 dollars so let's see how it goes maybe we can uh snag it maybe we can't let's see how this is going to work with that being said this pretty much concludes the flint buy shop international airport update number three for you guys thank you guys so much for watching this video if you guys enjoyed it don't forget to give it a like subscribe to the channel Turn on post notification bell so you better notified every time I post a new video. Uh, birthday massive unboxing like I've been mentioning throughout the video. We are, when I'm recording, nine days away. When you guys are seeing it, eight days away from my birthday. Uh, I am very, very excited for my birthday. So I'm finally able going to be able to unbox my model planes. Something very sad that's been happening is that USPS has been delaying some of the mail due to the cyclone. The Laura, the Laura thing that happened in Texas and everywhere. So they are delaying the packages uh, for a little while. This should get back and running up in like the next two weeks. So it should be, uh, all my packages should be here within the next two weeks. I was supposed to receive my Florida one today and I didn't. It was delayed. I was supposed to get a model that I bought for, of course, for my self unboxing, which I'm not going to say which model it was. Uh, yesterday the 31st as a recording uh, and I haven't gotten it yet so it's very very sad uh, but yeah I mean all we have to do is just wait we can't do much more than just wait for it to arrive be patient um, and have uh, uh, faith that we will get the models uh, good and fine the good thing is that the models they didn't take a chance for the models to get here broken because they could have gotten broken if they didn't care about the uh, hurricane that happened uh so 
If they would have cared, they would have not cared. The models could have been here, but maybe they would have been damaged. I don't know. They took care of them, which is very, very nice. Uh, so kudos to USPS. Thank you so much, United States Postal Service, for taking care of the models. Uh, but yeah, this has been a very uh, bad delay for the channel. Hopefully, we can fix that uh, very soon, and hopefully, we can get the models in. Uh, but yeah, this. Uh, with that being said, my name is Gemini Jets Fam. We've completed another airport update for Flint and Bachelor International Airport. And I'll see you guys on the next one. God bless you. Have a great day. And I also do want to make a little mention before I do end the video. Thank you so much, Citrus Aviation, for making me my intro and outros. Thank you so much. They turned out amazing. People have already seen it. He's an amazing guy. Go follow him on Instagram. His YouTube channel will be linked right now in the top. And it will be linked in the description below. He deserves a lot of followers and everything. He's very, very nice. Such a very nice and kind of person. And he did offer to make them both for free. So thank you so, so much, Citrus Aviation, for your work. I really appreciate it. Uh, and I will have a very good use for those intros and outros. So yeah, with that being said, without making the update any longer, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Goodbye. That was classic contact, Pacho.